Hello, good morning. I'm Kim from Kenya. We have just woken up at uh, 6.30. Nyae, nyae, my friends. Nyae. <laughs> so we just woken up and we thank God. So we want to do some morning routine, some work. People ask me where we fetch water. So I'm going to show you where they fetch clean water. So these people are very rich, very, very rich. And one uh, sheep, one goat, the minimum price is uh, $50. Just imagine $50. And the person have many of them. Just look. So they are being taken to the grazing fields, which is 10 kilometers. That's why you don't see men in my videos. They, they search videos because they really take animals to the grazing fields so so these people are pastoralists the main activity they do is just uh, taking care of livestock yeah in this place also they have uh, oil yeah they have oil Kenya usually drill the oil and also they have gold yeah So this one, they have to remain at home. They can't walk for a longer distance. The baby sheep, the baby goats, they have to remain at home. That's why they are crying. So they usually sleep here. The goats, the sheep, they sleep in this place. Yeah. So we have here baby sheep, baby goats. They can walk f for a long distance. So by the time they were taken from this place, like they were removed from this place, I was <laughs> sleeping. <laughs> That's why I've not vlogged. I've not shown you how they remove from this place, but I will do a video about that. So this is the house for the... A sheep for the goats yeah so it looks like this and this person has more than 200 sh goats and sheep in total these people are very rich Yeah. 
so this is the type of shoes I'm going to put on they are made from tire the material is from the tire very hard and then here it's from it's made from cow skin as you can see or cow hide I don't know how to pronounce it cow hide yeah and here it's the material from the tire the rubber so, so there are a lot of thorns here in the desert yeah you have to protect your feet from them so you know the thorns cannot pass through here and the place where we're going to fetch water it's like uh, 0 0.5 kilometers a half a kilometer um, uh, not far it's near so i'm going to put them then we go fetch water yeah so these are the desert shoes so beautiful good morning how are you i'm with akeno nyaya akeno how much good morning good morning so we are going to fetch water yes here's my bucket and he has a jerry can here yeah it's a beautiful morning we thank god and you're keeping fit you're keeping praying you're happy <laughs> you are safe you're keeping safe yeah so it is not far it's just near like a half a kilometer is it a half a kilometer yeah so let's go this is the main road it's sandy it has a lot of sand look at the sun ambience so beautiful yeah so yeah so it looks like this the main road yeah it is very sunny hey well very very sunny you know this is a desert interior of the desert like the village yeah but we have the town Woo, it's very sunny so i have to cover myself like this i cannot i cannot also <laughs> it's covering herself because where well, the sun is there There are three tanks here, big tanks. I, I don't know how many liters, but they have a little water. And this one was uh, drilled by the government of Kenya. So like these people, they don't suffer because they have water. Tanks with water, three of them. The other one is the other side. You cannot see it well. Yeah, so it looks like this. And that is where they fetch water. So here we carry things on our head, they carry water on their heads and then they have this thing to protect them from injuries. Yeah, so 
We are going back home. We have finished fetching water. That is the dirty water. We don't use dirty water. The water is very, very clean.